Yo, 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 what's going on? It's Blair the Car, guys. Y'all know the reason why I'm here. People, ever since that Zodiac um, tournament, people just been begging me. Like, y'all yeah, literally been just crashing my like inbox and everything. My inbox, I get on the end, people messaging me. Hey, Blair, where's the list? I want to see the list. I want to see the list, Blair. Let me, let me see, let me see it. So, begrudgingly, you know what this is. I have a list for y'all to use if y'all want to try and use this version. So, we'll go... I'm gonna show you what I played. This is the uh, this is the, exactly the exact list I played for that match. But before we start, um, I know I'm a little late, but I want to go ahead and give a shout out to Big Dez. If you're watching this, bigs up to you, homie. This is a shout out. I knew like I did the video last week. I was like, as soon as I got done recording, I'm like, dang, I forgot to do it. So I didn't forget about you. So Big Dez, this video for you, baby. You know what this is about. So let's get into the deck profile. Of course, one Joker. I have to. It's this didn't need to be hit, but I, this is literally like one you so many games like top decking it. But one, it hurts a little bit, but once you see it, then you pretty much got your engine. Once you see it and get your engine going, then it, you, it's really not needed at this point. You just got to adjust. Triple Sorcerer, of course. He's broken. Searches all your stuff, anything you need. One monkey board. Now, this really hurt. I didn't see this um, getting hit, but... It kind of hurts a little bit, but you just find ways to play around it. Like also the same, it's the same thing with um with Joker. Once you get set up, then you get you're fine. Uh, double Gee Turtle and double Lizard Draw, and also uh, one Silver Claw to round out the performance pals. The biggest thing I saw, the biggest problem I saw with this deck one after the hit after the adjusted list is the lack of high scales, like. You you really needed your you really needed your high scales now, and that's why I tried to I decided to still go double G turtle double lizard draw and then still keep the silver claw in because you need your high scales. But there's another thing I did to fix the high scale problem. Let y'all see later on. Uh, of course, one luster. Like you need this one there right now. Uh, two master and two. Whoop! It's under there. Two master and. Two vector. Um, I'm not. A lot of people are playing the rescue rabbit build. I don't like the rescue rabbit build because if you do your face off where you get to these and then you draw a rabbit, then it's dead. Even though it's still level four, but it's practically a dead card. And um, I try. I tested with three masters, and there was a lot of time where master um, clogged. It was a little different with um, like opening like multiple lusters because luster actually could do more stuff, and then especially with plus fire stuff. But plus fire not being a thing now. You don't want to see this in your hand. It's practically just a normal monster. And Vector's still um, pretty good in the scale. And then face off, of course. Uh, one Mask Chameleon. You have to play it now so you can have another uh, tuner. Um, since Luster is not one, so you can still make a Nister. Um, if your Vector or your uh, Master goes to the graveyard, you can bring it back and make another Ignis make an Ignister or whatever. And the fact that this is a searchable with Feral Amps is a really, they're really, really big thing. So you can pretty much get to this whenever you want. If you can make a rank four. And now the moment people have been waiting for, like practically, the Chronomalies, two um, Nibber Disc and one Jet. For those of y'all, everyone should know, but I'm going to say it anyway. For those of y'all that don't know what um, this combo is, pretty much you normal summon Nibber Disc. And like with this, your normal summon really doesn't matter. Since Joker's at one, your normal summon isn't as big as it used to be. But um, your normal summon never disc, and when it's summoned, um, it lets you search uh, another Chronomaly monster besides itself. And then if it's in the graveyard, you control nothing but Chronomaly monsters. You can special summon it um, from the graveyard, but you can't activate any other effects. That doesn't come up like that, so don't even worry about that. If it comes up, it comes up. But the thing is, you normal summon Debra Disc, you search Golden Jet. What Golden Jet does is a once per turn effect. Once per turn, you can raise the level of all Chronomaly monsters you control by one. So you go Debra Disc, search your jet, set your scale, pendulum summon whatever, pendulum summon out your jet and other uh, cards. Use Jet's effect, you raise Jet and Debra Disc up by one level, W level five. They're light machines, so when you do that, you overlay into Cyber Dragon Nova and then go into Cyber Dragon Infinity, as you saw in the uh, streamed match on the Zodiac in the Zodiac tournament. So it's really, really strong. So it's still the deck still has a chance to make Infinity without the use of Ptolemaeus. And I play Triple Wisdom on. Um, the reason why um, I decided to play Magicians in here, so 
like I said, like I said before, um, the biggest thing that you had a problem with was high scales. So I added the magician, so I had more um, opportunities to make high scales, and the fact that they still work with performer pals outside of monkey board. I did it to work with them is perfectly fine, and also the fact that Joker can search the still, like it's just broken. So what it pretty much the Joker would depend on your hand, you can pretty much search either the magicians or your performer pals and still be able to go off. It's really broken. And then along with the magicians, I played two poles and one uh, pit. Another high skill: the removal, monster removal, spell trap removal. Uh, one like, Arch Phoenix Century. I still play double max C, um, just because still in the mirror match, like you still want to get that advantage um, from them trying to go off. And especially if you like, it's the same thing. If you go first and then you set up your board and you have this in hand in the mirror match, and they have to go off to try and out your board, you do this, then they have to really think twice about. It. Especially if you have like Reflasia or a Nightmare or something on board, then they have to think twice about like going off under max C. Uh, that's all the monsters. Uh, spells, triple wavering eyes, still needed. And now, like, with Joker and Monkey Boy being at one, this fixes your bad hands. And then now, uh, like, in the mirror match, like, this is literally unstoppable if they don't have their own. Um, two, face off. I've been an advocate of two. It's still a broken card, and it still searches your luster, but I don't like three because the, more times than not, the third one will... Um, more likely to be dead. So a lot of times the second one is even dead for you. So I just like playing too. And it still works out fine for me. Um, I play, also of course with the Magicians, I play Double Pendulum Call. Um, you said a short, um, just discard whatever you don't need or whatever, or whatever, and then search your Magicians. And then this where you don't lose the Wavering Eyes, and then you just go off. You don't lose the Wavering Eyes, you don't lose the Twin Twister, and you just go off with that. Uh, double instant fusion. Double instant fusion is needed um, right now more than ever, because um, this this literally fixes your brick hands. Like this helps you get out of like awkward situations. So double instant fusion is definitely the way to go. Uh, one twin twister uh, for back row, of course, and then only two traps to play are bottomless and um, treacherous for reflation. All right, let's get into the extra deck. Don't have a side for y'all, but, but I hit down the hit on the extra day. Um, just real quick. Abyss Dweller, Diamond Dyer, Aflasia, Scott's Broken, Majester. Majester is really good now. Now you can just search your missing pieces and then bring back your luster, bring back your master. It's really good. Majester's really good now. I really need it. I still play um, Nightmare. I still have a lot of dark targets. And it's still... Like really good against the mirror match, like all the pencil summon everything. Good against other matchups that special summon BA flip one face down, flip one face down or whatever is really good. Uh, Pallades, um, just for uh, the chronometer play as well. Just in case if I need to make if I need to make it instead of Infinity, then I'll go into this uh, Nova and Cyber Dragon Infinity, of course. Uh, Castell, Staple. Uh, Feral M, search out your Lizard Draw or your um, your Mask Chameleon. Double Ignisty, broken. Uh, double Norton to go with the Double Instant Fusion. And Dino Stir to wrap up everything. But that is the deck profile. I really hope y'all enjoyed it. Y'all got what y'all asked for. Like, literally just hounded me and hounded me. So I hope y'all really enjoyed it. If you, if you did enjoy it, like, leave a like. Make sure you leave a like, leave a comment, say what you like, what you didn't like about the deck profile, things that you changed. What would you change if you were to um, like play this build? What would, what would be your changes and everything? Do you agree with like the ratios that I did? Uh, let us all know. And if you didn't like it, just rewind it, uh, rewatch it. I promise you'll like it a second time around. But Blair at the car, guys. See you.